Hi Jay, let's try and work this out, and if it works for you, then I'll re-record this video for everybody else. Um, so here's what it looks like on my machine. Um, I can, oops, I can open a command prompt. Um, it, when I type Java C dash version, I'm running version 16. Uh, where I, when I type where Java or even where Java C, um, it's pointing me to program files, common, Oracle, Java, Java path, Java C dot exe. Um, so, so I'm assuming that when you type Java C space dash version, that's when it says there is no such Java C. Um, try this, open your file explorer, go to C drive, um, go to program files, go to Java. And inside here, you should see JDK something. Um, and whatever it says, that's the version of the JDK you have. Um, that's if you have a 64-bit JDK. If you have a 32-bit JDK, go back to program, oops, go back to Windows, go to program files x86 instead, because this is where all the 32-bit software lives. Um, you'll notice I don't have a Java in here because my Java is 64-bit, but you would, you would see a Java in here and then same thing, you'd see the JDK. Um, so why don't you tell me what you saw in those places. Um, I'm assuming you have a JDK and all we need to do is set the path. Um, let me just tell you what that is for the moment. Um, so just like in programming, you have variables that save important values, like the operating system also has some built-in variables where it saves important values, um, and those are called environment variables. So down here in your search bar, you can type environment variables, and you want to edit the system environment variables. You can also reach this by going through the control panel um, to get to settings. So this bottom button here says environment variables, um, and not not my user variables, but my system variables. If you go to path, what the path is, is it's a list of directories where uh, important programs live. Um, so that, that way, if you try and execute one and it's not, you're not inside the directory of the program you're trying to execute, it will check all of these other places on your path. Um, so if you click edit, you'll see that right here at the top of mine is that same that same directory, program files, common files, Oracle, Java, Java path. Um, for you, so so one thing that you could probably do to get it to work would be to add a path to add a path to wherever you actually saw the JDK. So it would be, you know, like C drive, program files, Java, JDK. Um, I think you do this instead of the bin folder. Mm, it might be either. Well, anyway, why don't you tell me what you see, and then and then we'll work out the next step. 